cleanses the temple. It's what it's called. So starting in verse 12. And Jesus entered the temple and drove out all who sold and bought in the temple. And he overturned the tables of the money changers and the seats of those who sold pigeons. He said to them, it is written, my house shall be called a house of prayer, but you make it a den of robbers. And the blind and the lame came to him in the temple, and he healed them. But when the chief priests and the scribes saw the wonderful things that he did, and the children crying out in the temple, Hosanna to the son of David, they were indignant. And they said to him, Do you hear what these are saying? And Jesus said to them, Yes, have you not read? Out of the mouths of infants and nursing babies, you have prepared praise. And leaving them, he went out of the city to Bethany and lodged there. Okay, so just that's another little place from in that particular day. So it's start turn bad for them. So anyway. Um, Robert Moody and Joe Hudson um, are presenting something. It, I don't know the name of the song, but I know that Robert has something to do with uh, the com composition of it. Is that right? Yes. Did I just say that? Oh, yeah. No, that's right. Okay. Well, here you go, Robert. Thank God for Dan and for the opportunities and uh, for willing ministers and my brother Joe and Kathy and Ms. Miller. And the uh, Bible says the singing to the Lord a new song. So I have absolutely no problem coming up with a song every now and then uh, to try to offer up to Him. And the funny thing is that God uses, uses those in my life more than anyone else. So. God's good. The Bible says, Philippians 4, it says, Rejoice in the Lord always, and again I say rejoice. Let your gentleness be evident to all. Do not be anxious for anything, but in everything, I lost part of it there, Joe. But in everything, <laughs> I had it before I came up here. <laughs> it says, uh, it says, but, in everything by prayer and supplication with thanksgiving, let your requests be made known unto God. And the peace of God, which passes all understanding, will guard your hearts and minds in Christ Jesus. And brothers and sisters, I'm here to tell you that the Bible's true, and God is good, and that's what this song is about. When I get down on my knees, and my life is all a wreck I don't know what I'm gonna do I just rejoice in the Lord And I give it all to Him And He takes all my worries away Don't be anxious, don't worry Rejoice, the Lord is here Don't be anxious, don't worry Just the Lord is near, just put a little faith in God, He's watching over you, over you. When you go to God to help you with a thankful heart, then I'll tell you what He's going to do. He'll give you peace that you just can't figure out. He'll take Don't be anxious, don't worry, rejoice, the Lord is near, just put a little faith in God, He's watching over you, it's better over you. When you get up in the morning and you don't know what's ahead, can I tell you of a better way? You just rejoice in the Lord and you give it all. Don't worry, rejoice, the Lord is here Don't be anxious, 
And but it kind of goes in this in the same same uh, area. And I just want to read this, uh, starting in verse one. Then the kingdom of heaven will be like ten virgins who took their lamps and went to meet the bridegroom. Five of them were foolish and five were wise. For when the foolish took their lamps, they took no oil with them. But the wise took flax of oil with their lamps. As the bridegroom was delayed, they all became drowsy and slept. But at midnight there was a cry, Here is the bridegroom, come out and meet him. Then all those virgins rose and trimmed their lamps. And the foolish said to the wise, Give us some of your oil, for our lamps are going out. But the wise answered, saying, Since there will not be enough for us and for you, go rather to the dealers and buy for yourselves. And while they were going to buy, the bridegroom came, and those who were ready went in with him to the marriage feast, and the door was shut. Afterward, the other virgins came also, saying, Lord, Lord, open to us. But he answered, Truly I said to you, I do not know you. Watch therefore, for you know neither the day nor the hour. And then the parable of the talents, for it will be like a man, the kingdom of heaven again, it will be like a man going on a journey, who called his servants and entrusted to them his property. To one he gave five talents, and to another two, and to another one, and each according to his ability. Then he went away. He who had received the five talents went at once and traded with them, and he made five talents more. So he also went to the one who had two talents, made two talents more. But he who had received the one talent went and dug in the ground and hid his master's money. Now after a long time, the master of those servants came and settled accounts with them. And he who had received the five talents came forward, bringing five talents more, saying, Master, you delivered to me five talents. Here I have made five talents more. His master said to him, Well done, good and faithful servant.